Hello guys, this is Ravens from DJ Integrity. Today we are going to see some of the interesting news for the day in Tech News 161. And DJ Integrity wishes you a happy 75th Independence Day. Facebook Messenger announces that it is introducing new features and more security in voice and video calls. The communication app has been in a surge of voice and video calls more than 150 million video calls per day. Facebook is introducing an option for end-to-end -end encryption for both video and voice calls. This won't be an automatic change. Users will need to opt in end-to-end -end encryption and this will only work with other recipients who have also done the same. Disappearing messages are also been updated with new controls. Users will now able to let Let messages disappear from a little as 5 seconds as much as 24 hours. The much awaited electric scooter from Ola Electric is almost here and we already know that it is going to be launched on August 15th to coincide with our Independence Day. But now we have confirmation regarding the exact time of launch as well. The company recently published a tweet that confirmed that they will be hosting a virtual event at 2 pm during which the scooter will be launched officially. IQ new flagship model IQ8 series is scheduled for official release on August 17th. Now the official has been several rounds of warm up. IQ previewed the gaming capabilities of the IQ8 series. It comes with a dual control under the screen pressure sensitivity touch and comes with a dual X axis motor stereo dual speakers called Competitive King comes with a buff. BGMI Freedom Face Off event in Battlegrounds Mobile India is all set to take place on August 15, 2021 and will feature 16 popular streamers with their teams. These 16 teams will battle it out against each other in the intense battle royal matches. Much to the excitement of BGMI fans, Crafton has announced a prize pool of 150,000 Indian rupees. Realme GT Master Edition price in India have been leaked. 8 GB RAM and a 128 GB storage comes for 25,999 Indian rupees, while 8 GB RAM and a 256 GB storage comes for 27,999 Indian rupees. As per the previous tweets of Realme, Realme GT price could be about 30k. This was confirmed by the Realme India itself. Realme GT 5G, GT Master Edition and Master Explorer Edition are set to launch in India on August 18th and right ahead of the scheduled launch in the country. Realme CEO Madhav Seth has shared that Realme brand's X series will be replaced by the GT series. To be specific, the X will be replaced by the GT, so the GT is the new X from now. While the other smartphone series from the brand will not be impacted by the GT series launch. This marks the end of the road for the Realme X series, which primarily offered in the affordable mid range to upper mid range price category and offered some interesting and great value for money offering in the past Xiaomi is gearing up for the Redmi 10 launch. The company has officially teased the launch of its upcoming budget phone. The teaser poster confirms some key details of this device. It will come with a quad camera setup on the back. The camera module text further confirms that Redmi 10 will have a 50 megapixel primary camera. This device will come in three gradient color option. There is currently no word on the Redmi 10 launch in India. The company is expected to confirm the official launch date in the coming days. New MI notebook has been teased once again. It will feature a webcam and a 16:10 to 10 aspect ratio. It will come with a backlit keyboard. Apple is expected to launch iPhone 13 series in September this year. iPhone 13 series is expected to be similarly priced to the iPhone 12 series. Apple is also expected to introduce LTPO panel mode with a 120 Hz refresh rate in its Pro models. The upcoming Poco phone has been listed on the Indian IMEI database. It carries a model number 211033MI. Security researchers has warned users about a new delivery scam that is doing the rounds. The scammers send messages with malicious link via WhatsApp informing users about their online orders. The cyber criminals then ask users to click on that link that is provided with the message to complete the process. As we are all using Twitter, we have seen a lot of blue ticks distributed to prominent celebrities or media persons. If you wanted one of those ticks for your account, you are sadly out of luck. Twitter has confirmed halting the verification process for a short while, hoping to improving the application and review process from the interested members. But there is a still no date has been mentioned, which could mean you have to wait for a weeks or maybe months. Twitter verified have been consoling annoyed members, promising to bring the service back as early as possible. Thanks for watching this video please kindly support my channel by giving a like share and subscribe and follow DJ Integrity on Twitter Instagram and Facebook